Hi guys, it's the RPG Brit here, and welcome back to my let's play of um, Tales of Rise. So we're still just trying to get out of here. Glad to see Here's you the mate. leader. I heard you managed to escape, but I didn't expect to see old Iron Mask with you. In any case, we're all wanted by the Renans. It'll be easier for everyone if you both just come with me. Where are the others? They're waiting for us up ahead. Come on. Okay, here's another one of those anime cutscenes. It's incredible. Oh dear. Stay where you are, dissidents. Just look at all these soldiers. How badly did they want to destroy this hideout? I think it's her. Slaughter the rest! Take the arrow out. Why did his mask light up like that? Is that a flaming sword? A blazing sword. Wow. He was embedded within her all along. No matter. Kill her if you have to. Just retrieve the core. Attack! I'm guessing it's the existing sword that I had. Wow. I hope I can do that when I'm actually fighting. Okay, maybe not. It obviously takes quite a lot out of him. And the sword actually disappears, so maybe it is something that I'll, like, summoned. You okay? That's so cool. God, look at his arms. <laughs> Your arms! <clears throat> oh, yeah. How about that? Guess it's just as well I can't feel it, huh? You're not in agony? Wait, are you serious? Hold still. Huh? Oh, can she heal then? Oh, yeah, it looks like it. That's good. It's one of my healing arts. A sword that sears the hand of he who wields it, and a healing art to mend. A man numb to pain, and a woman whose very touch deals nothing but. Hmm. It's like complete opposites. Thank you. <sighs> All right, let's rout the bastards and finish them off before the surviving stragglers have a chance to regroup. Iron Mask, you coming? Definitely. I'm not about to go back all that way alone. So I guess you're not planning on releasing me, huh? Sorry. You're coming with us. In that case, there's one thing you should know. No one uses that flaming sword without my say-so. You needn't worry on that score. I doubt many of us could get close to it in the first place. Or would want to. Hmm. <laughs> So maybe it's not something the I can use all the time sword. then. It just might be strong enough to match the power of a lord. No, maybe even to surpass it. Are you sure you're okay? Uh, what do you mean? Your wound. That soldier nailed you pretty good. Not to mention those flames bursting from you. They only hit my master core, so I'll be fine. 
And the flames weren't even hot. It's probably because they're just a manifestation of the astral energy. Honestly, I'm more surprised that you really are incapable of feeling pain. Did you think I was faking? No, I believed you. I guess seeing you stay calm while bearing those burns to your hands just really made it hit home for me. It's ironic. I have no problem hurting anyone who touches me. But as soon as I try to wield that sword, it's me who gets hurt. Do you wish you were impervious to pain too? You realize you could burn your fingers off without even noticing, right? So what? All I need right now is power. And up until now, I haven't come across anything stronger than that blazing sword the whole time I've been doing this. You really don't care what happens to you as long as you get what you're after, do you? Don't talk like you know me. Uh. <sighs> you... <sighs> you're right. I, I think they're going to butt heads quite a bit I don't get in this. so quick to throw it all away. Not when us slaves have never had a choice in whether we lived or died. <sighs> I befriended her. Okay, is that what you call it? Zephyr has teamed up with your party. Nice, I'm guessing we've got three now. Um, so, Xion specializes in gun based long range strikes and astral arts. Uh, <clears throat> use her to hit enemies from a safe distance and to use healing arts on allies with low HP. Healing arts cost CP to use, so mind your CP total. Auto mode. When auto mode is enabled, Shinon will primarily target flying and astral art wielding enemies as well as foes with lower HP during combat. Okay, that's cool. Arts with healing and support effects consume cure points CP. In addition to AG, CP is shared across the party and can be restored with items or stay in at an inn or campground. It can be raised by leveling up or finding specific items. Alright, cool. Let's have a quick look around here to see if we're missing anything. It doesn't look like it. Well, let me just come down here quickly. Here. No, can't go that way. On. We're moving to another base. Jesus, everything's on fire. All right, so we've got to go loop around to there. There's a lot of cutscenes in this. Well, I suppose it is the beginning, so you're. It's introducing a lot of um, characters and lore and stuff like that, so. I don't mind, though. Hopefully, you guys don't either. That's the symbol for this area Land of Brimstone and Swelling Ash. Nice. So, I'm guessing we're going to go to all five of the different um, districts or. Regions or whatever they called. Glanamede Castle, stronghold of Lord Balsef, self-imposed ruler of all Calaglia. I've never seen it from this close before. That's it, all right. And next to it are the Gates of Fire. Take a good long look while you still can. That wall is what we've come to tear down. The only thing standing between us and freedom. Freedom. Let's go. All right, cool. So we're obviously going to take down that lord. Then we did think as much. I wonder if um, we take down the lord in each five of the areas. If you get close to a zoogle, they'll attack. Uh, making contact with an enemy icon will initiate a battle. Defending, defeating all the. Ah, damn it. Put it come back up. No. Oh, combat. No. Oh, I don't know. It's fine. We'll figure it out. Let's fight. Changing controls during combat. Summary. During combat, press options while in the menu to change your character's control mode. Semi-auto. Automatically moves until in attack range. 
manual full control auto fights based on set strategy so we could just do the whole thing in auto uh, semi auto mode is designed for players who only wish to casually dabble in combat meanwhile manual mode is for those seeking full control while auto mode lets the game take the reins Okay, I mean, I, I want to do auto, uh, not auto, I want to do manual for the time being. They still take quite a bit of uh, fighting, but if I just focus on one, I'm glad the others just auto fight, to be fair. Less talking, more pummeling. Cut them apart to your heart's content. I'm sure I can put this to use. Sharp fang, nice. Right, let's carry on. Don't fight any enemies you can otherwise avoid, all right? Makes sense. If we try to take them all on, there'll be no end in sight. You sure won't hear me complaining. Mm, it's obviously wanting me to run up there, but I'm going to try and fight it. Normally, I don't pick on the weak. Here I come. Okay. This is it. Like this. Yeah, this is gonna be a lot tougher. I'm guessing we shouldn't be doing this. <laughs> Although we're halfway, so maybe if she keeps her healing up. There we go. Nice. I need to be stronger. Nah, you're good. Doing really well. Got a chest up here. A life bottle. A miraculous medicine that heals KO from one anti during battle, as well as restores 800 HP. Supplies like that are valuable. Never overlook them. Well, I'm gonna try and go up here. Remember that. This just looks like somewhere. Yeah. So I thought. I think this, this area was designed for you to avoid that fight. Maybe you run up here and just run round. But I did see this from down there. Antidote rock. I sense a strange power from it. Yeah, see, then you just run this way. But we still done it. Is that a campfire? It is. Let's stop a moment to catch our breath. But I barely worked up a sweat. Speak for yourself. What do you want, a medal? Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't look like we're being followed. Fail to grab these rare moments of quiet when you can. You'll end up regretting it later. You're the boss. Yeah, you're going to want to rest and save as much as possible, especially if you can't replenish like, your CP. Camping out. Resting at a campground will restore your party's HP and CP. While resting, you can watch skits and cutscenes that you've previously viewed. That's cool. Normally, we should take turns standing guard. Zephyr, why aren't you oh. concerned about who I am? I didn't realise that was going to interrupt him talking. Some? No, it's not that. But you said you wanted to fight so that you can live a free man. At this point, that's all that matters. Even if it somehow turned out you were a Renin, it wouldn't be such a big deal. A Renin? Until we know who you are, we can't rule anything out. That is true. Besides, we've already got Shion with us. At this point, what's one more Renin as long as they're on <laughs> our side? So you don't see every Renin as an enemy? Our goal isn't to hunt down and kill all Renins. We only arm ourselves as much as we need to. To set ourselves free. If you can believe it, not every Danon agrees with what we're doing either. Are you saying we have enemies among the Danons? Uh, not quite. They're just not up for rebelling, per se. The thing you have to remember is that everyone has their own path to walk. I'm not sure I understand. That's okay. Just focus on what we have to do right now. However, the time will come when you'll need to decide what to do for yourself. That's cool, I like them. Oh, look, Iron Mask Missing Core. So is this another one? How come you don't have a scar? Oh, yeah, it is. On your so head? this just triggers this. A scar? What do you mean? I like him. I'm going to do him whenever well, I see him. The pros all tore off their own spirit course, right? But 
Your hand doesn't show any signs of ever having a core like theirs. Why not? I... don't know. I don't remember anything about myself from before Doc found me. Seriously? You have that mask, you don't feel any pain, and you just happen to know how to fight with a sword? No way. You must remember something. I'm not lying, if that's what you think. Believe me, I wish I knew who the hell I am. But I don't. It's funny how I didn't have any time for soul-searching while digging up rocks in a mine. Still. Are you saying you've told us everything about yourself? <laughs> Good point. It's bad manners to pry when you've got plenty to hide yourself. <laughs> <laughs> You're not gonna ask me about my past, too? Only when I think it's necessary. You're a real man of mystery, I'll admit. That said, I'm not one to dig around in someone's business just out of curiosity. If you remember something and feel like sharing, you're free to do so. For now, I think that's good enough. Right. Thank you. I like him. He seems really down to earth. Oh, we've got another one. How many of these so are we going to have? Whole you not feeling pain thing. Is that for real? Why would I lie about it? And why would you care anyway? No, it's just, you know, I can't imagine what it's like, that's all. As a slave, I'd say it has its advantages and disadvantages. Oh? On the upside, when Ren and soldiers push me around, I hardly flinch. <laughs> the downside's that I get injured without even noticing. Which means I could be knocking on death's door and not even realize it. Really? Sure. I may be numb to pain, but that doesn't make me immortal or anything. Still, I wouldn't have noticed any of this if someone hadn't pointed it out to me. If not for my fellow slaves, I'd be long dead, lying in a ditch somewhere. Alright, that's it. So, reminisce. I'm guessing that's um, look at previous um, things. Downloadable content, I'm not getting any of that. Display party status. Okay, so that's before we've rested. And then menu. Okay, well, let's rest. He was still talking. You see that? His mouth was still moving. A master core, huh? Well, what is a master see. core? So that's why Balsef's cronies were so desperate to catch her. Is that what it's called? The jewel in her chest? I guess we're going to find out. Oh, right. You don't remember a damn thing, do you? Ah, fair enough. I guess it's time to fill you back in. Tell me, you ever wonder why we Danans are made to work ourselves to the bone, day in, day out? Well, when you put it like that, I always just assumed we were mining resources for them. And don't you think it'd be quicker if they used all that high-powered tech they have? Why go to all the trouble of relying on weak human labor? That's a very good point. Listen, what the Renans are really after isn't resources or minerals. It's astral energy. They're harvesting the astral energy that sleeps inside all matter in life forms. And they're doing it the same way they have for the past 300 years, using us Danans as mere siphons. Right. They have machines for minerals, but extracting from Danans requires spirit cores. Any astral energy collected passes through a spirit vessel on its way to being stored in a master core. But why go to the trouble of collecting all this energy in the first place? Do they really need all that juice just to use astral arts? It determines the Sovereign. Sovereign? Is that the Renan ruler? Exactly. Five lords, each doing whatever it takes to gather as much astral energy as they can and store it in their master cores. Whichever of them manages to accumulate the most power at the end of their contest is crowned the ruler of the Renan Motherland. A new crown contest, as they call it, is held every decade or so. So you see, the master cores are the receptacles in which the lords store their power. And we Danans are sacrificed, so the Renans can choose their new ruler. That's insane! You're telling me that's what our people have been dying for this whole time? Relax, hero. You're not the only one who's bent out of shape about the whole thing.
There are two things that I haven't been able to get my head around yet. What business would a Renan have stealing a Master Corps? And what's the deal with that blazing sword? I think the sword is a physical manifestation of the Master Corps' astral energy. As for why it took the shape of a sword, well, I don't know any more than you do. Honest. And that stuff about needing your permission to use it? What was that about? I'm the only one of us who can control the Master Core to some extent. Without me to adjust the flow of astral energy, the sword can't take a physical form. What do you want out of this? You may be one of them, but you don't strike me as the ruthless oppressor type. I'm going to take down all of the Lords. There we go. So yeah, we are going to take down all five, or at least aim to. I thought I'd say this, but I like the cut of your jib, Renan. <laughs> I wonder if he's going to join us, because it only said Very he joined well. our party, but I haven't as befriended him. As far as we're him. concerned, the struggle continues either way. And with that sword on our side, our chances of victory just increased. That is, of course, assuming we can count the two of you in. Yeah, well, I'm definitely Fine in. by me. After all, it sounds like we're after the same thing anyway. So we get a team up to fight this I... lord, but whether he stays with us or not. Honestly, I'm still a little confused by all this. But if it's a choice between this or going back to being a slave, then I choose to fight. Then it's settled. Together we'll overthrow the Renan lords. And first up on that chopping block is Balsef, the wild beast. Sound good? Yeah, so he wants to join us. We've overthrown all of the lords. So I'm hoping he is with us now then. Because I do like, I love his character. I say he's really down to earth. <clears throat> he makes a lot of sense when he's talking. Oh, what's going on here? That's the thorns. They were mentioning thorns, um, some of the guards, when they were after her. I've got to hurry. Oh dear, is, he, is she on some sort of buried time? Is that the noise it makes once you rest, maybe? <laughs> we have another secret hideout in Ulzebek, not far from here. We should be able to meet up with our comrades there. I hate camping out. Right, well, let's grab this and then we'll head on our way. It mostly seems quite linear at the moment, as in there's not that many different paths. What is going on here? Oh, we should be wheat. able to eat. Of this. course. Whenever you find some, make sure to grab it. Edible, huh? well, I should have read what it said then. Definitely. So I wonder if this has got a um Well obviously it's also obviously got some sort of food aspect where it's got a cooking and giving you boosts and things like that. <clears throat> That'd be quite cool. Good, is there a way to come down this? Oh we can jump down. Oh, we've got another Cut it out. Didn't anyone ever tell you it's rude to stare? What is he staring at? I already asked you this, but are you sure we haven't met somewhere before? <sighs> What's so hard to understand? I'm Renan, you're Danon. There's no way. You don't know Besides, that I'm Danon. I'm from Lenigus. Trust me, wherever you were before you lost your memory, we've never crossed paths. Lenigus? You mean the same Lenigus that's up in the sky? I've heard it called the Renan's Castle, but I never imagined people actually lived up there. Well then, where did you think we all lived? Didn't you see the Renan Lords descend for the crown contest? And how long ago was that? Well, the current contest started seven years ago, so... Then I wouldn't remember. Just how far back do you remember? About a year, give or take. That's how long ago Doc found me. One year. Then no. I'm sorry, but there really is no way we could have met. Guess not. Well, it could have been before that. What's that got to do with anything? <clears throat> Although, he can remember something. 
Oh. Carp, nice. We just gone fishing. And some sage, nice. The icon still stays on the map, so I wonder if it respawns. Maybe once you've left an area and come back, or if you've rested, or maybe. Maybe it respawns then, who knows. I'm sure we'll find out. This is quite a climb. Alright, let's carry on. That's where they blew up the track. Oh, I was literally just thinking I haven't come across enemies for a while. But there's some there. Mushroom, an umbrella shaped fungus often found in moist areas. How is it moist here? Poisonous varieties exist, meaning caution must be exercised when picking them. I'm guessing that's a different colour then maybe. Oh wow. Yeah, we might not be able to beat that just yet. Um Look around here, there's nothing else here. We've got some more enemies there. Let's take these guys out. And we can get those items that are behind them. Nice. Just notice that when you when you do a move, it then not the swallow blade. It then let you let me do another skill after that, and it done a lot of damage. Have to look out for that. All right, some more wheat. Nice. To bake some bread. What's this thing? Oh, was there something there? No. Okay. Well, let's fight these ones on the bridge. And then we've got to go that way, but I do want to try and fight them. That big thing up there. I might save it before I do, just in case we are massively out um, outgunned. Yeah, that's Mirage as I fall down. That's cool. But I've, I've just noticed two of my buttons are both for the same skill, so I'm hoping I get some new ones very soon. What is that? Hoot hoot. Dogtail? A dogtail resembling that of a wise, noble Shimba Inu that when... Oh, Shiba Inu. Yeah, that's actually a type of dog. When combined with a set of ears, making it tempting to run around barking everywhere. Okay. That's an unusual bird. It's an owl. They're often used as a symbol to represent ancient Dana. Uh, Dana, I'm just going to be... Uh, uh, I, d I did read it. It was saying that they... If you find them, they'll give you they'll give you items. I have to keep a lookout for them as well, then. Right. So, yeah, I am going to... Um, save this quickly. And then we're going to try and fight this thing. Save on a new one. And once I've fought this, I am going to win this video here. That's so it's got run of the mill enemy. It's got a special symbol there, so I'm I'm thinking this is not going to go well. But let's try it anyway. If not, I'm assuming we can come back here and fight it anyway. So. Ah, uh, level 43 Don't Mantis. Yeah. Don't tell me. Uh. I'll bring you back from death, huh? As if the Don't bother. Aren't I was overconfident. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I think we were a little overconfident. Oh, what happens when we die then? Okay, recovering from party defeat. When a party is wiped out of normal fights and losses, it costs CP to recover it. 
in that same area while you still return to the same area even with no CP you won't recover HP meaning that retreating to accrue HP is, can still be wise okay right well we can't fight that so um, so yeah I'm gonna um, I'm gonna end the video here actually I'm gonna actually load that bit before we fight them because I don't want to lose all the CP and the HP um, but yeah cool still absolutely loving loving this game the look it just looks incredible the story sounds really really interesting I mean I love my Japanese animation anyway my anime and it, it just feels like playing an anime um, so yeah really really like it so far if you guys like it please uh, give the video a like um, consider subscribing to the channel and uh, I will see you in the next one thank you very much and take care